Hi everyone, Caleb with Parker 360. In this video, we'll be going over the features of your Scout Dolly and how to connect it with your trailer. The ball mount provided with every Parker 360 unit provides a convenient and safe method of connecting with your trailer. It works as an extension of your coupler. Sliding easily into your dolly's receiving tube, it will allow the dolly to swivel and pivot underneath your trailer. Here, we have the tightening bar for your dolly's ball mount. It's included in the kit along with your Scout trailer dolly. To store your tightening bar, simply slide it into the clips that you've installed on your dolly's handle. Weighing only 28 pounds, the dolly can be easily transported or stored when not in use. For compact storage of your Scout, simply detach the handle from the body of the dolly. This makes it perfect for storing on a shelf or in the trunk of a small vehicle. To connect the Scout to your trailer, you'll want to start with the ball mount. We recommend using the thrust washer in order to create a flush connection to the coupler. Check the hitch ball to make sure it's the correct size and that it's screwed to the correct height. The shoulder of the hitch ball should be about flush with the top of the ball mount, or in this case, the thrust washer. Line up the hitch ball with the weld spots facing towards the back left of your trailer at roughly 10 o'clock. These welds prevent the hitch ball from spinning inside the coupler when tightening. Place the ball mount into your trailer's coupler, then latch it down. Use the latch pin to secure it. Hand tighten the ball mount by turning it counterclockwise while holding the thrust washer in place. Once hand tight, we'll use the tightening bar to finish the job. Insert one end of the tightening bar into one of the holes on the side of your ball mount. Continue to tighten counterclockwise until snug. With the ball mount fully secured, line up the Scout's receiver tube with the bottom of the ball mount. Lower the tongue of the trailer to insert the ball mount into the dolly's receiver tube. Keep one hand on the dolly to make minor adjustments as needed. With the trailer's jack post fully raised, this will transfer the tongue weight of the trailer on top of the dolly, creating a secondary jack post on the front. Thanks to the ball mount's stable lock technology, the Scout will remain completely level and secure even while pivoting. The Scout's one-wheel design makes it easy to turn and move in any direction. Compared to most two-wheeled manual dollies, the Scout reduces the amount of friction and manual force required to operate it. When operating a manual dolly, be sure to follow all of the safety operation guidelines to prevent injury to yourself or damage to your trailer. Always operate your dolly on flat and level surfaces. Do not push or pull the trailer on a grade higher than 3%. It is always very important to remember to move the Scout using both hands to maintain control over the dolly. When pivoting the trailer dolly, keep both legs planted and use your entire body to rotate the Scout. Once any trailer chocks and stand supports are removed, it's time to move the trailer. If you experience any issues with your dolly, if anything's missing or anything appears to be damaged, please feel free to reach out to us directly. Thanks very much for watching the video today and happy parking.